Got new gods, goddesses, kings, queens. Got new Gotti, the Nazi, Greek family, allies, enemies. Was had this little double rice. Right? So look, man. Hey, I'm about tired of these Aborigines, Turtle Island, uh, Muraka, with uh, the, all the different names they giving stuff. They they snatch trying to go snatch. Now they Cherokee, they the Creek, they Indians. When when history is known that. Columbus thought he was in India, but he wasn't in India. He started calling them Indians, and they say that they're not Indians. They say they're native, but then we know that they come from the Mongols, which is Asian, that they are Asians, and they Asian uh, bred, and we know that the, the uh, Omex is African, but they say the Omex is not African, and all this not African. Then they go into Africa, start picking and choosing what part of the culture they need and want to take and uptake for themselves to make their culture seem like it's the bond and everything was over here. I even heard one go as far as say that Egypt was in America before it was in Egypt. That sounds stupid. Uh, Mississippi is actually the Nile River. So it's like, why would and then white people lie to us, want us to all be African? Why would white people say that great structures are built in Africa, but it's really in the United States? It's like, look, 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 look. Aborigine, Turtle Island, indigenous, Niji, feathers up, black people that's not Africans. You motherfuckers are stupid, homie. I, I, I'll bash you, homie. Y'all stupid. Do y'all think white people got a lot of y'all? They fucked you up. As a matter of fact, if we want to start looking at this from any nation, nation and nation, if the Aborigine, black, Native American, Indians, not African people, if want to go to war with Afghanistan, y'all would get fucked over. Y'all would get fucked over by any group of people on the face of this planet. Y'all the weakest fucking people on the face of the planet. Why you say that, Slip Double? Well, let me tell you why. Man, these are the only people on the face of the planet that lost everything. Everything in the same place that they're original from. I, nowhere else in history has that ever happened. So let me tell you why these are the weakest people on the face of the planet. They lost their language, they lost their culture, they lost how to farm, they lost everything about themselves. And they lost it so bad that they was walking around in circles that they were saying that they African American. Well, really, we American Africans. Bow. You know what I'm talking about? Uh, yeah, well, yeah. Let's, let, let's go ahead and tie the American to it. You know what I mean? Let us know where we're from because we got a certain type of experience. ADOS, we are around here real hard, like real about that shit, real African with it. But anyway, they was fucked up so bad and, and, got, and got so hurt that they, they had to come and cradle up under us to, to they gain their strength. Once they start to gain their strength and they start to see, well, we had our movement, ADOS, you know, we want reparations. Black power, oh, we got the got the uh, Kemetic structure coming out. You got everybody coming out. Then out here, you got the Hebrew Israelites saying they not African either, but it's all good. They Hebrew, you know what I mean? They Bible, anybody fuck with the Bible, fuck up. But anyway, so now they, they starting to see everything okay, and ain't nobody getting beat up. And, and, uh, okay, now we can come out. And, we're, we're Aborigine. We're not African. You whole ho ass niggas. These are some bitch ass niggas, man. I, got, I don't think y'all understand how bitch that shit is. Where was these motherfuckers at during the civil rights movement? Where was they at? And, and why is all they leaders under 40? And then they got this nigga named Dan Calloway. This bitch ass nigga. Man, oh man, fuck that. I'm with black on black crime. This bitch ass nigga right here is going against everything we working for. Don't nobody see how this motherfucker tear down the building blocks we built for? Slavery didn't exist and people was actually working. It was a job just like we working today. It wasn't no slavery. This old whole ass nigga is sleeping with the enemy. Oh, walk around greased up booty ass nigga. This whole ass nigga, if you notice, and I asked my homeboy, I said, show me the video where Dan Calloway told you about his family lineage. Why are you worried about his family? Where are your people from in Africa? I'm like, huh, cause like you don't even know where your people from. So I start telling them where my folks from. My great grandma, I said my grandmother, my great grandfather, my grandmother father, his father, and his father father. What happened? They had to run. No, 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 good. See, I told you where, my, where your people from? Louisiana and Texas. I'm like, cuz you said Louisiana and Texas. What? Why? Why you? Don't, you Aborigine, nigga. Don't say Louisiana and Texas, cuz. 
Because I could tell you if it wasn't for the Africans in Haiti that you wouldn't even have a Louisiana purchase, the United States, because of the Haitian Revolution, the proletariat in 1701. Oh, uh, uh, slavery didn't start to start to like the 1800s and then it ended in 18. Slavery. Um, okay, slavery didn't start to the 1800s. Okay, so go ahead and prove it. Let me see. Then motherfuckers start sending me, sending me shit, and he be like, well, you read it. You want me to read it, and basically you want me to debate myself with the stuff that you're sending, and the stuff you're sending is supposed to be fact, and the stuff he's sending when I read it, I start pointing out inconsistencies. Then he tell me I'm stupid. And then, you feel me? I'm stupid because you tell, you go send me something about dogs and how Anubis was originally Mexico, and, and that's what the Mexican dude saying that Anubis, that the Africans stole Anubis from Mexico, and Anubis was originally uh, from Mexican, a Mexican deity. I don't know how, um, but then, and he's aborigine to his land, so I asked my homeboy, so are you Mexican? No, he not Mexican. He with the copper color skin people, and he darker than me, you know what I mean? That's kind of fucked up, because I wish I, you know what I mean? But it's all good, I gotta accept the skin I'm in, I'm really dark skin. But anyway, so he uh, tell me, and I'm like, so you believe that now? So, so are you Mexican, like, you feel me? And the Mexicans wasn't even around during the time where he talking about Anubis. Mexicans was not around. So we know the Mexicans came about with the mixture of the Spaniards. Mexican, if you were to take Spanish out, now you have a different type of people. And we know Mexican come from mestizos. Mestizos are mixed people, they're mixed breed people. We understand that, you feel me? Even everybody knows that. But they're not, so you now, you use it, him trying to use that history and say that that's him. No, we know that the Omex predates them. You could go into when they was uh, oppressed. Gaspar Yanga is an African. Now ask him, well, explain Gaspar Yanga. Aborigines, these motherfuckers don't explain that shit. And then this motherfucker, let me tell you this bitch ass nigga, Dane Calloway, girl. This nigga's a bitch. This, uh, he, ain't, he ain't even a nigga. What is, he's a Nietzsche. This Nietzsche's a bitch. You know what I mean? Because he, he wasn't the one that they called nigga because he wasn't the one enslaved. They enslaved the Africans. They didn't enslave the Aboriginals. And I had to put that out there like that. So when the reparation checks start coming, I don't want these motherfuckers to say, I, 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 I was African. No, hell no. I got some African blood. Don't know. You motherfuckers don't believe in DNA. And y'all not African. So this is a good thing that you bitch ass niggas are not African. So the more you motherfuckers we can have say y'all not African and jump over there to the Aborigine boat, it'll be way easier to get these checks. You know what I'm talking about? We can just chop these numbers down and start really, we need, you know what we need? We need a motherfucking uh, a list, a roster of all the Africans that was enslaved in the United States and that was here and that traced their lineage back here. We need that. We get that roster, we get this written down, and then we take that. These Aborigines and the Hebrew Israelites, you motherfuckers can't get on, man. Fuck that. To me, that's some bitch ass shit. Well, I can't say that for the Hebrew Israelites again because the Hebrew Israelites, they do be pushing a line, but except they shit ain't gonna go nowhere. They gonna run out of gas because they ain't got no land mass that they connected to. These motherfuckers just waiting for thermonuclear missiles. And they just, uh, uh, Jesus is going, Yahshua is gonna send thermonuclear missiles and blow all this shit up. That's like a suicide pack code. You feel me? But anyway, back on this African and, and Aborigine smashing. Man, these motherfuckers are some of the dumb. These motherfuckers say that the Mississippi River is the Nile River. Homie, for you to take a whole river out of Africa, why do you have to do that? Because the reason why they have to say that Egypt was in the United States first, uh, uh, that lions, these motherfuckers go as far to say that lions is originally from America. Because these motherfuckers, my homeboy sent me a, a video and talking about camels and lions and all that originally from America. Then they show me some cartoons to say, look, see, this proves it. Cause that's a cartoon, cuz. So I'm like, all right, all right, all right, all right, that's cool. So when did the lions pack up and say they want to move to Africa? You sound stupid, cuz. You sound stupid. Nobody said the lions packed up and moved. Well, how in the fuck did this animal that you said was originally in America get to Africa? This is a... Man, see, cuz you be thinking you weird, cuz you weird. I, I'm at that. Isn't that a legitimate question? How in the if lions, deep mother, I got to, I gotta be stupid for trying to trying to explain some what I think is common sense that the lions didn't be like, you know what? Hey, babe, rawr, fuck America, babe. Let's go to Africa. 
Rawr. And they packed up and went to motherfucking Africa. <laughs> These motherfuckers. Hey, cuz. I'm Aborigine. Bashing. I don't mean the, Abor the real Aborigines in Australia. I'm talking about these motherfucking turtles. These motherfuckers say this Turtle Island nigga, y'all new name is Turtles. Y'all the red man. And I do mean red man. We'll call y'all. No, but see, but then they trying to say they copper color, right? So the blacks is the Africans. The reds is the Mongoloids that been here. The, uh, you know what I mean? You know, the Mongol, because they come from the Asian people uh, that been that came here. The yellow is the other Asians that been here that wasn't, uh, I guess I guess you could say that the red man was mixed with Because uh, so there was, it was, it had to be some kind of mix. Anyway, um, the brown is the Mexicans. You feel me? So these motherfuckers like, we copper, we copper. <laughs> These motherfuckers, hey, look, hey, homie, they would have fit in so bad. From now on, I'm going to dedicate my whole channel to making sure that we divide us up. Man, fuck that. And all that unity shit, motherfucker, talk, I'm not unifying with nobody that don't want to get in height. And then these motherfuckers, I got to say this. They say that the people in Africa don't call themselves Africans. Is that the national anthem? Must I take a knee? I must take a knee. Cause I got, I don't understand what the, homie, are you telling me? This is what you basically saying. You saying that the people in Africa don't know they Africans. This is what you saying. And I try to explain that to my homeboy. I said that you saying that the people in Africa don't know they Africans. Man, if you could show me a hundred people from different parts of Africa that say they Africans, and I say, look, I do better than that. I saw him a picture of the African presidents in the African Union. I said, this group of men is called the African Union. These are the presidents from those African countries and the presidents that people voted for. So if you're telling me those people aren't voting for African presidents, that's a part of the African Union, then what do you do? What do you say? I didn't get no reply because a motherfucker don't know how to argue. And then I put him on the phone with a brother that worked at the plantation where I'm at. Uh, and the brother say, I'm Nigerian. No, he said, we African first. Man, you not African, you Nigerian. Now you just gonna go tell this motherfucker where he not. Okay, I'm telling you, you not Cherokee. I'm not gonna tell you you not a Cherokee, an Aborigine. You don't even say that. I asked you what's your original language. You don't even tell me that. All right, tell me some language. Motherfucker could tell me that. All right, tell me where the land ass, where y'all was from. Why y'all didn't build shit? This is another thing that they do. So, you know, I'm bashing, homie. I'm doing 15 minutes of bashing. I got two more minutes. So, look, this motherfucker say that, oh, 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 go to South America, all in Peru. They not the same people, cuz. How you go to Peru and say that y'all the same thing as the United States? You still got Mexico, Panama, and all that shit in between. Two totally different people. But but th that's cold. And I say, okay, because we both from Congo. I say, with well, the South Sides and the Santana, the same thing. You sound stupid with your analogies, cuz they not the same. They Santana blocks and we South Sides. How in the fuck they in the same city, right close to each other, that you say that they different people, but all of a sudden that you could be the same person as a motherfucker in South America, cuz you can't, it can't be no Turtle Island without South America. So you know why? Because in the United States, the Native Americans didn't do shit. And niggas tell me, we got mounds that's older than the pyramids. Wow, nigga, you got hills of fucking dirt. You got miles of dirt. Motherfuckers took some pills and kept dumping it. That is awesome. That is a magnificent structure. Took some real math to build that shit. Um, so look, this is what I'm saying. All you Aborigine turtles, uh, whatever the fuck, indigenes, you motherfuckers, homie. Y'all some fucking weirdos. Y'all some weirdos. Then y'all gonna say the white people lied to us. And then the then go prove that the white people lied to us by showing us the records that the white people written. You motherfuckers are some backwards ass niggas. And I'm bashing, homie. I'm bashing. I'm, I'm bashing. I'm smashing now. Black power banging this for real. I'm with the black on black crime, homie. On the real. And I'm about to do some criminal activity to you motherfuckers on this YouTube. It is going down. Y'all might want to start reporting me because I'm about to get real aggressive. Where my books at?